fast food chain uses this innovation kitchen to try and come up with its next big hit. Now it's looking to target Gen Z with its brand new chicken nuggets that KFC US head chef Chris Scott helped to develop. So many of younger consumers are not interested in eating chicken on the bone. For whatever reason they choose, they don't want it. That's great. Now we actually have an opportunity for them to fall in love with the company all over again. Hey guys, today we are back at KFC because they're bringing something out today that they've never had since this company started. Bobby, do you know what that is? I do know. Chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. Can you believe that? No, I'm surprised they've never had those before. Didn't even notice that till I saw that these were coming out. I just always assumed that. I knew they had the popcorn chicken, mm -hmm. so I guess that was their chicken nuggets. They discontinued that. So we're going to head in there, try some of these chicken nuggets. They're supposed to be pretty good is what their ads are saying. And we're also going to pick up, Bobby, a chicken pot pie in here. We've never gotten one no, of those we've either. we've never tried those. We've always said we were going to, but we never have. So Today's the day. It is. Today <laughs> is the day. So, guys, let's head into KFC and see these new chicken nuggets. So, are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Well, let's take a look at all the prices for these new chicken nuggets. Eight piece, $4.49 chicken only. Chicken only on the 12 piece for $6.49. Now, if you want to take home 36 pieces, it's going to cost you $19.48. Combos, eight piece, $7.99. And the 12 piece is $9.99. And we're going to throw in Bobby's pot pie. She got a drink with this, $5.99. All right, guys, let's take a look at the new KFC chicken nuggets. I got the combo meal. It was $7.99 for eight nuggets. Let's just take a look at those. There's a little box that came in, 100% white meat. They look pretty good. But I'm impressed with this chicken pot pie that Bobby got for $5.99 with a drink. That's pretty good size. All right, let's look at these new Kentucky Fried Chicken Nuggets, 100% white meat. Let's take one out. The original recipe does not come with extra crispy yet. It says these are 100% white meat chicken nuggets breaded in our original recipe seasoning served with an individual side with the combo and roll and 11 herbs and spices. They look a little bigger than the popcorn chicken that they normally have here. Now to make room for these new chicken nuggets, they have discontinued the popcorn chicken, the KFC chicken wings, the strawberry lemonade, and Bobby's kind of sad about this one, the chocolate chip cookie. What do you think of that? Chocolate chip cookie, that is always so very good here. But let's just break one of these open. The juices are flying out of more grease because you know KFC. I like that. That's not processed chicken. Looks very good. I don't know what it looks like to you guys, but it's pretty good to me. Let's try this. No sauce. My first reaction to these guys is that they're pretty good. The original recipe comes through great on these. I normally like the extra crispy, but on these, this is fine. It reminds me of just biting into a chicken breast from here. Tastes the same thing, because it's the white meat. The popcorn chicken they had, if I remember, I think we only had it a couple times. It wasn't quite as big as these. I like this. I think this is a pretty good thing to the menu. I mean, they're all different size. Let me get, it's all different size. It really doesn't look like a nugget, because I think uh, McDonald's uses processed chicken nuggets, so this is another player to the game. Chick-fil-A and McDonald's. This pretty good I recommend this I'm gonna try this in this new buffalo ranch sauce let's try this buffalo ranch it's a newer sauce hasn't been around a long time get that in there now that's not too bad of a sauce but I think I like just a plain buffalo I like buffalo ranch but this one take it or leave it they have their regular what new KFC sauce we got some honey mustard and Bobby's gonna try one of these 
All right, Bobby's going to give these nuggets a whirl, but they have a motto here. The motto on these nuggets are, you have never had chicken nuggets like these. They're the chicken nugget America deserves, and they are worth the wait. So let's see if Bobby thinks that motto is true. All right, now when I first see them, they're all different sizes. To me, they don't really look like chicken nuggets. They just look like pieces of chicken, but that's what they're called, chicken nuggets. Wow, you can really taste all those 11 herbs and spices. I love this flavor. I might have to go back to the original chicken instead of the extra crispy, John. But nice uh, white meat, nice and tender. I like these. And we'll try a little bit of the sauce. I like the honey mustard sauce. I'd probably go with this one over the other two that you had. But with all these spices on this chicken, chicken, I mean nugget, <laughs> you don't need any sauce. So these were 70 years in the making. Was it worth it? I like them. I think they got a good flavor. But like I said, they don't remind me of a chicken nugget just because of the different pieces. This one does. Since we just didn't want to come in here and try chicken nuggets, we're going to try this pot pie. We keep seeing it up there. Bobby's always wanted to get this, but we always come in here and get the chicken because it's hard to come to KFC and not get the chicken. But this chicken pot pie is going to consist of tender bits of fried chicken, diced potatoes, peas and carrots, and a savory sauce baked in a flaky crust. Let's go into it and see what it looks like. So that's a very nice size pot pie. It does look like a nice flaky crust. I'm not sure whether to go in with a spoon or a fork. So I'm just going to go in with a spoon so I can get in and get a little bit of everything. I can smell the chicken. Well, look at all that. There's some peas. Now oh, that is a very buttery and flaky crust. Look at all that. I'm going to see if I can go in here a little bit more so you can see inside. But they put plenty of chicken in there. That is very hot. I took a bite. I think I got a little bit too big of a bite, so be careful if you get one of these. There's some carrots. But look at all that chicken. John, you would like this one because I don't see a lot of vegetables in there. No, it's loaded with chicken. Though. It is. And it's and the up crust. pretty nice. Very good. I'm glad I tried this. I will definitely get one of these again. All right, guys, I'm going to try this. Bobby said I would enjoy it because there's not a lot of vegetables in there, and there's not. Man, that's just loaded with chicken. Now, there's a big piece of potato right there. But abundance of chicken in there, and look at the steam coming off. I don't know if you can see it on there, but trust me, it's Be coming careful. off there. Here we go. Bobby, why have we not tried this before? I don't know. This is very good because I've seen it before. They'd have it up on the window for five dollars or something like that. Which for the on combo Tuesdays. was it's only five ninety nine for the combo. Maybe the combo is five dollars on Tuesdays or whatever it used to be. I don't know if it's still going on, but like Bobby said, there's just so much meat in there. There is a little bit of vegetables, but look at that. Can you see that out there? Look at all that. That's worth that price. And I do enjoy this. I'm not a huge fan of pot pies. I like that one we got up in the Amish country. But I will also get this again. Coming back for some more info. April 3rd, KFC's bringing back their bowls. Last year they had the popcorn chicken in them. We tried them. They weren't too bad. That Nashville hot one was very hot. This year they're going to use these. That's going to add some bigger pieces of chicken. We might have to come back, Bobby, and try those when those come out this year. But Guys, you need to get out and try these. I mean, you can decide whether you want to pay, what were they, for eight of them and the combo with the drink, $8. I know that might sound pretty expensive, but they are very good. Take my word for it. You want a bite? Okay. Break it in half for you? You want to see some of that? There you go. Go ahead and take a bite of that. And the last thing I'm going to say about these is they don't seem as greasy as the normal chicken. That's why we usually get extra crispy because when you get the extra crispy on the regular fried chicken, it just doesn't seem as greasy as the original. This isn't really greasy at all. When we first broke that one open, we saw some stuff come out of there, but they are very good. I'm recommending, maybe these are a little healthier, but I doubt it. I just wanted you guys to see, look at all that chicken. I can't believe how much is in there. I know it's called a chicken pot pie, but I was expecting more vegetables. This is excellent. I would definitely get this again. 
Well, there is as much chicken in that pot pie as there is in a three-piece meal. Probably I think you're more. Right. There's probably more. All right, let's take a look at our receipt here at KFC. We had the eight-piece nugget combo for $7.99. If you just wanted the chicken only, it is $4.49. Bobby's pot pie combo, $5.99. Grand total, $14.96. Hey there, this is your Colonel talking. Now I got something here that's downright fun. My new popcorn chicken. Crunchy morsels of tender white meat. It's mouth popping good. Woo, look at them go. Hurry down to KFC, try my new popcorn chicken for $1.99. It's more fun than watching me, unless of course Colonel get funky. Go Colonel, go Colonel. At KFC we do chicken right, and not just in a bucket neither. Well, we just left KFC after trying their new chicken nuggets, guys. What did you think about it, Bobby? I think it's a great idea to do chicken nuggets because a lot of kids don't want whole pieces of chicken, especially if you have smaller children. Like my grandsons would love these. Um, the only thing, they weren't all the same size, which I could see my grandkids saying, eh, that, that's not a nugget. But I like the original recipe they used on them. But if I come back here, I want to promote that chicken pot pie. I mean, it's the first time we've ever had it. If you are someone that doesn't like the skin of chicken or you think their chicken's too greasy, get that pot pie. It was loaded with chicken. It was nice and moist. But the one thing I do want to say, I think KFC made a mistake by getting rid of that chocolate chip cookie. I knew you'd be sad when I saw that. I didn't want to tell her. I didn't want to tell her about yeah, that, guys. Because I think now what's left is a little chocolate chip cake or something. Is there... Mm -hmm dessert now maybe they'll have a new one because they got rid of those items to bring in new items i kind of hate that they got rid of the little chicken wings but i know a lot of people didn't buy those those were good the hot wings now let's talk about these chicken nuggets i've had chick-fil-a nuggets i've had mcdonald's nuggets these are better in my opinion i know we don't usually compare stuff like that but these are definitely better this is better tasting chicken i think than the pieces of chicken you get in there because there's not as much grease i said that mm -hmm. inside so. you could really taste the spices in these i mean that was an eight piece thing you saw it about this big that would have cost you 4.49 if you just wanted the chicken is it worth that you can decide that for yourself i would get those again i thought they were very good i think that's a great new addition to the lineup those are going to be good in those new mac bowls that are coming out here in a couple weeks so i was impressed but like bobby said that pot pie, mm -hmm. I was impressed with that. I was too. And they've had that here for a long time. We just have never gotten it. It was just so full of chicken. And I said that in there. It looked like it has more chicken than what a three piece chicken dinner would have. I think chicken. it did, but it tasted great. So and KFC the, did a great job today. The flakiness of the crust. Was yeah, very it was good, all wasn't? very good. Mm -hmm. I was happy with this meal in here today for lunch. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J and B have left the building. building.